All right, howdy, boyos, and welcome back to Heroes and Generals. Um, a couple of days ago, I uploaded a video that was basically a subscriber challenge, or a viewer challenge, however you want to call it, where uh, one of you challenged me to get kills with only a knife, um, and I, I tried my best, and I, I, did a, I did a pretty decent job. Um, I kind of cheated a little bit and might have used a Panzerfaust or two and jumped into an AA gun and got one or two kills, um, which was rightfully pointed out by uh, some of you, but um, I kind of feel like that, I mean, I don't know, maybe it's cheating, uh, but I think I did that quite well. I managed to get away with, I think, 30 kills and 15 deaths. Uh, today, I felt challenged to do a, again, challenge by one of you guys in the comment section, um, in which I'm only allowed to use the hip fire on a bolt-action rifle. Now, the thing is that the bolt-action rifle is fully upgraded. <coughs> Pardon me. It's fully upgraded, but having only hip fire is going to be, uh, it's going to be interesting. I'm, I'm quite interested to see how this is going to work. Um, I mean, I have to say, I'm a big fan of the iron sights on these bolt action rifles, but, uh, you know, we'll see hip fire. It'll be interesting. Um, if you want to submit your own challenge for me to take a look at, and probably, maybe, perhaps do in a upcoming video, just leave it in the comment section right below, and, uh, I'll randomly pick one for my next kind of subscriber slash viewer challenge. Um, it just gives me something else to do in Heroes and Generals that's not, you know, I don't know, I, I feel like... I have basically done everything in Heroes and Generals besides, you know, some of the tanks and um, like maybe one or two guns, even though I think I've literally done almost every single gun in the game as well. Um, so I figured it was time for some challenges from your end that I probably had no, didn't think of yet myself. Um, and so far I've been, well I mean, the, the knife only challenge I think I've done before, but like having a, a bolt action rifle and only hip fire is, is, is pretty funny and I have to say I'm, I'm actually pretty excited to see, ooh that's bad. Now, the challenge never stated anything about tanks, so let's just assume... Oh, there's another tank up there. Let's not fuck around with that. Wow, really? Alright. Well, I just almost fucking died. Well, there's two guys next to this bridge. Here I was really thinking that I was going to one-shot him. Maybe he had, uh, maybe he had a uh, heavy set on. Anyway, um, well, I mean, bad start. It happens. We got. Wait, I got a kill. Oh, maybe my assist count. Maybe my kill, my assist counted as a kill. All right, let's keep moving in. I also didn't give myself a med kit this time because people were quite upset about that last time. Um, so I'm going to try it out with uh, no med kit, just a car, and if we find any medical stuff along the way, I'll obviously pick it up, but um, well, I guess we'll just do it from as vanilla as possible for now. Uh, this is going to end up nothing. Let's just go run. Oh, my bike's gone too. Ugh, fuckers. All right. Whistle, whistle. Get across the bridge. Not a lot of people in here today. Uh, lots of bad pingers too, which is actually an issue if you're trying to... Well, I guess I have good pings. That might not might be in my benefit. Jesus! I didn't even see... Oh, well, camouflage. Uh, fucking actually works. Hmm. I just need to get into the city. And I'll be fine. Let's jump on a bike and... Uh, nah. <clears throat> Let's stay on the left side of the bridge this time. Ooh, I thought he was gonna bomb me there. No, but let's stay on the left side of the bridge this time and uh, try not to fucking fuck around too much. So I'm going to say Panzerfausts are okay against vehicles, not against infantry. Uh, I kind of feel stupid if there's a Panzerfaust box next to me and I'm not grabbing it to kill a tank. Um, but I'm not gonna use them against infantry like I did in my knife game, because uh, I, I do agree that kind of broke the idea. There's a fucking steward right up there. There you go. Surprised that this. I, mean, I guess this guy has heavy set because this is a one-hit kill sniper for sure. 
It really sucks not being able to zoom in. Um, it actually is not easy. It requires lots of those CSGO skills where... That's why I kind of... That's why I don't like CSGO. Um, it's probably because you guys are like, Oh my god, Sherman, you're such a fucking noob. But in all seriousness, I just don't like CSGO because most of the guns you just can't zoom in with. That's why I disliked the original Halo so much, and that's what probably drove me to buying a PlayStation and not an Xbox, because uh, I just disliked the first Halo so much where most guns, I'm not saying all guns, but most guns in Halo were like this hipfire idea only. And that's why I dislike CSGO. I don't like that you have a fucking AK in your hand with perfectly fine iron sights, but you can't ADS. And I get that it's a game thing. I get that it's part of fucking CS. You don't have to explain that to me. I know that that's just part of CSGO. But it doesn't make it less stupid or frustrating to me. Because I personally think that... Zooming in with a gun is half the fun in a game, and I don't know. I'm sure that- I'm, I'm, I'm sure that- oh my god, that's so dumb. Ah! Fucking one second. Not even, like, half a second too early. Uh... Fuck, where are we gonna spawn? Fuck, I guess we'll... I guess we'll just spawn a bike here and go there. Uh, but no, I just... I'm not a big fan of CSGO. I don't like the fact that you can zoom in. And I'm sure people will be like, Oh my god, that's part of the skill. That's The, the game has been that way ever since it got first. You know, ever since... Uh, what is it again? Counter-Strike... Oh, no, I forgot the fucking first name. Or just the original of Counter-Strike, I guess. I just... I don't know. I'm not a big fan of not zooming in and doing this challenge where you cannot zoom in. I don't know, it kind of resembles uh, CSGO to me, although other people can zoom in. Um, I'll be honest with you, uh, using the op in CSGO, I'm, I'm in no way a great CSGO player. Um, I forgot my rank. I was like the rank above the, the single AK. Fuck, I don't even remember the fucking name. Um, I, wasn't, I wasn't good by any stretch of the imagination. I was just a very average player, maybe slightly above, but... Oh, there was a guy in that fucking 50 cal for one second. Um, I was maybe slightly above the average player. But, anyhow, um, I don't want to talk about these. Go to this entire video, because I feel like that's a bit stupid if I'm playing heroes in generals. Uh, but yeah, uh, oh yeah, if I used an op, I felt a lot more at home, especially because you could zoom in. And uh, doing those one shot kills in the op was always very entertaining. Now, we are at 0 oh, 1. I drove my bike there. It's a safe way to get here to town. I need to start crouching more when hip firing because I think. Yeah, it makes your thing smaller. When if, if you're prone, it was really tiny then. Alright. Let's move up. There's a guy on the machine on the roof. Let's go kill him. That was pretty good. A A. I should do a quick scope. Uh, I should do a quick scope challenge where I just come. I'm, like, I'm only allowed to do this. So fucking dancing. Uh, go on. <sighs> Sometimes the um, the jumping in here in general feels like I'm on top of a fucking spaceship. Like the jumping feels really gravity, like lose from like. I don't know. I feel like it feels like I'm separated from gravity while playing H and G sometimes. It's the only downside of the game, in my opinion. Well, there's a couple of downsides, but the major downside for me is the jumping is very frustrating. Is there a fucking guy in there? No! Wow, that was interesting. No, God, fuck it! 
Damn it! I don't know how I didn't kill that fucking pilot. Damn, I suck. I seem I seem to have lost my brain cells with this challenge. Oh wow, we're losing the eel line pretty fast. I I think they need my help with some quick scopes here. Ooh, I could have driven a 222. Oh, I already see another challenge coming where you can just be only allowed to drive like a Kubel or a motorbike or a, an armored car and only run over people and not use the guns or jump out and kill them. Or like a knife and run over challenge only. Give me some leniency. My car dies. It's not in this house. Oh, there's two enemies here now. Oh, the bike stopped here. Why would this pig and this guy went upstairs and or jumped out? I'm really scared. <sighs> okay, we killed them. Oh, no, wait. Okay, never mind. We got it. We got you one. I can die. No! How did he not die? Look! Damn it. Well, at least I helped. It's holding the objective. That's what I'm. <sighs> That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to hold the objective so at least we wouldn't fucking lose the E-line, which I think I helped because there was two enemies there and without me they, they would have captured it. Or at least I was there as a body to stop them from capturing it. So far I know do goo. Not zooming in actually pretty sucks a lot. It's not easy. I got one of a, I got one kill there. That's actually a pretty long range snipe too, and I got a kill system on the other guy. Oof. I don't know if that guy died or not. Alright, we're attacking E3. I think, uh, well, I mean, as long as I end up positive at this challenge, I think this is actually harder than the knife challenge. Because, uh, with the knife challenge, you just have to run up to a person, and you basically get a kill. But with this, people with heavy set, which a lot of people run, obviously, they will screw you over. And then there's the fact that long range, I mean, I guess you can't win long range fights with knife only, but... I guess this this just comes down. Oh, I got kills. This one just comes down to like I said, just having a very keen eye and looking for these guys. They're very long range. If you want to get a long range shot, and you have to be. Why? I'm fucking. I'm walking here. That's fucking retarded. I don't know where this guy ran me down. Uh, is there any? Fucking two two two. Would I want to spawn that? Well, oh, we'll spawn a fucking, we'll run on foot. That's so dumb though, like, this guy just runs me over, like, okay, it happens. It's, it's, I've done it too before, but at least you can say, he's like, oh shit, sorry. But that was a bit like, oh, well, fuck me too then, eh? Fuck you, I thought he was gonna bomb me. There is a tank over there. Or something. But hey, I helped. I helped getting the Eli back. There's a guy on the left side of his house somewhere. He's dead. That's a flag grenade. Oh, got a kill. I 
There's gonna be some Americans here. Because we are approaching E4. Oh, I thought it was a fucking Jeep about to run me over. Apparently it doesn't really matter because I have to be as afraid of friendliness of enemies in this game because this guy just <laughs> ran me the fuck over. Alright, this is gonna be rough. Crossing this river with hip fire only. Where'd that guy go? Damn! Damn, boy! I'm actually quite proud of myself with that one. I saw him, it was hard to see that guy. There's some. Sh oh, there's a steward shooting into the river. Oh, this makes me so sad. I wish I had. A f I wish I. I wish I could zoom in. For some of these people. I'm gonna lower the sensitivity of my mouse just now. I'm, I'll just turn on my siege settings for my mouse. So I r normally run 1100 DPI. I think. Either 11. I think it's 1100 DPI. Uh, this is 3600. Don't use that. I just use this for memes. This is like 1100 and then I use 900 for Siege. And I really do feel a difference between 1100 and 900. Um, especially with my in-game stuff in Siege where I set uh, the stuff, you know, a little bit lower. And um, I play lots of Siege just for fun. And I'm, you know, I've made a couple of videos on it. I tend to make, I want to make more videos on it. Most just some casual where we have some fun. Um, I'll be honest, making ranked videos is pretty rough. Because uh, doing, doing goo in ranked isn't something that I'm really necessarily bad at it's just I feel like it's a lot more stressful Get fucking wrecked. to the point where I just have more fun playing casual um, because you know my friends are just gonna fuck around and make a joke here and there and this guy just fucking got wrecked people not having a fit again over oh my fuck Ah, oh well, at least we made it into the town. I helped. Uh, I forgot to spawn the other fucking side of the fucking river, you fucking fuck. Um, but you know, I've been playing lots of Siege, and I uh, usually use 900 DPI with some in-game settings that I like. Um, and I feel like that's, I don't know, I feels like, I feel, it feels a lot better to me. Oh, fucking dicks. I feel like a lot better when I use the 900 DPI. Uh... I know, I know you can look at a tank and it marks it, but it's so hard to do. It's so random. Sometimes I look at a tank and it doesn't mark it. Sometimes I look at a tank immediately and it marks it. I kind of miss the old Battlefield 1942 thing, which um, is like, uh, you know, you, you hold Z or Q and you could like mark stuff and everyone on the team could see it. Obviously some people would abuse that, but there was like a very simple system, which is like you can only put like one mark every minute or whatever. It was something simple like that. So at the very most, you would have 32 marks, but I don't know, it wasn't that bad. Uh, I, I think that was how Battlefield 1942 did it. Um, okay. I wish I could see into that window, but... We didn't lose B4, you fucks. All right, we need to capture some of this freaking ground. There's tank crew fighting amongst us. Bikes over here, a little noise truck. There is some. He's dead. Nice. Or was a guy like right over here? I'm ready to fucking crouch. I'm ready to drop shot some boys. I can hear people running around over here somewhere. Is Rick getting a one? Was there, there a guy like right here? Fuck, we lost E4. 
fucks, man. I don't even know what fucks, man means, but I do, I do mean know that that's under fucking annoying as balls. I have to go back to E4, and there's gonna be a tank and a Gakazal. I guess O2 would be good, but we're losing B4 too, I think. There's not enemy deploy. Oh, there's enemy deploy zone here. Oh well. Sucks to be you. Don't kill me. Alright, we're going back to E4, because that's what we do. Oh, there's a fucking enemy right here. I, I, less than half of our health, and less than half of n less than half of our health, and I injured him with the quick scope there, and we're losing the B the B four pouring, and we've lost the E fucking four point, and spawning there will allow me to fucking spawn way back. So let's spawn on the fucking B one line, and we cannot spawn. Uh, fuck it, fuck it. Oh, well, you know what? Motorbike. And we'll just go back over the bridge. So far, this challenge is uh, tougher than I expected it to be. Um, really didn't think much of this challenge. I was like, oh, this will probably be very easy. I'll, you know, I'll get a couple kills. I'll feel really badass. Um, but yeah, I realized that hip fire in this game is not very... Is, well, that's not true. I use it for SMGs quite a lot. Especially when I'm in a pickle and it's like, fuck, I have to use my gun right now. I really don't want to have to spend time to zoom in. I think uh, hip fire works out just fine, but using it on a bolt action rifle and CQB, definitely something different. There's a tank right there. There's infantry on like a motorbike or something. Fuck it. I can try and capture O2 though. Let's go in. Mm. I'll go up the church here. See if there's anyone inside. Nope. Now the issue is uh, using a hip fire from up here is going to be very interesting. Gun down. Memes? You gotta be kidding me! I should have gone for the headshot, but I didn't think someone would survive a 792 to the fucking chest from two feet away. Fuck you. Damn it. Besides going for a headshot with fucking hip fire seems like a bad idea. I flanked that guy around, I scared the balls out of him. I'm surprised he even looked around that quickly. Oh my god, that's so unlucky. Right. There has to be a bitch boy in here. Probably on the stairs, because that's what I would do. Nope. I wait for some people to come support me here, because uh it'd be great. Maybe we can have some people help at B4? Nope, I'm the only person here. You know what? I'll go have to kill myself. Three, two, one. Da, 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 da. Fuck! I keep hitting these people and they're fucking. Ugh. Damn it. See, I forgot about. I forgot about this. I forgot about that meme. I forgot that people are going to have heavy set out of the fucking B3 as a tank. I forgot people would have heavy set. That's so dumb that I forgot about that. I'm running it myself too, so I mean, I mean, I, I understand. It's a good. It's a good perk to have um, because it basically stops you from being one shot unless it's a headshot. So it's a really good perk. Um, 
but it's annoying as fuck for me because I don't know I've had three or four times where I would have definitely had the kill if it wasn't for the fact that they had heavy set on and it really ruins the fucking one shot kill ability <laughs> I like that guy name anime is cancer let's keep pushing up Plane. Plane. For one second, I thought that was a landing craft or whatever. Can I get in this guy's machine gunner slot? I don't want to. Oh, I can heal from him. Alright, well, we got covering fire going on. Really, dude? You're fucking luck so you can't kill a guy. Oh, I got quick scope, fam. Someone hit him before though, so I got lucky. Okay, that works. I'll take a kill assist. Cross the river, let's go, men. I will take lead with my bold action hip fire only memes. Let's go. Oh my god, there's like two people behind me. This is amazing. It's like an actual charge. No, it isn't, but... Oh, there's fucking three enemies in this fucking objective. Get wrecked! Oh, shit! Oh, I only saw him the second I... Oh, well, I saw him, and that's why I yellow shit, and then... Damn it! Why is there a tank right there? Where is our friendly? Also, where's the beeline going? Yeah, I'm gonna go uh, spawn on the beeline because apparently we're getting recaroonied, pepperoonied. I'm gonna run back to the main HQ building, I guess. Oh, that sucks. Oh, there goes B2. So, or I think there goes B2 anyway. Oh no, we're capturing back B3. Never mind. Good job. Uh, I almost pressed B to put my gun away like PUBG and start running, but then I realized, oh shit, this isn't PUBG for some reason. Okay, well, mm, 14 to 11. It's not great. Like I said, my expectations for this were a lot higher. Didn't think it'd be too difficult getting hip fire kills. Uh, with a sniper, and then I realized that most people run some sort of heavy set, which doesn't allow me to one shot them. Now, there's a guy like right in front of me right here. So I can barrel stuff this guy. <laughs> Fuck! Fuck, man! I killed, oh my god, I even, I hit the shot on my, mm. damn it, I don't, I look, I like, oh my god, if that pilot wasn't there, I would have killed that guy, the, oh I guess, if the pilot wasn't there, I wouldn't have had to kill him in the first place, but whatever, fuck it, this guy in that window, I'm so un I'm so unlucky that, that there was a second guy in that building. I could have killed the guy in the corner. I really need to s kill these people and get in here. The upstairs. Oh, he's dead. Or he jumped out. Oh, he jumped out. I'm ready. I'm just doing this so I can keep my gun pointing forward. Come on. Whistle. I think there's other guys at Car 98 too. This might be bad. I think it was time for me to get to the roof here. Is that guy is down here somewhere? Run at me, come on. Come on. Come on. I lucky you. Oh. 
Reload. Is that a grenade? Ooh. Uh. Let's get wrecked, fam. Get wrecked. I'll take uh, that's my first kill streak, I think. Actually, that's probably not true, but it's one of my. Oh, and an car M1 car M1 M2 carbine. Damn it! There's like four. How are there so many people there? Okay, we're gonna get in a motorbike. At least my kills got a buff. I went from like what? 1512 to 1813, so I did got, uh, get a, I grabbed a couple of kills there. It wasn't great, but it was better than doing nothing. And I got my motorbike here. Oh, there's baddies. Oh! Now that is a fucking wholesome meme. Get fucking wrecked. I saw you coming, fam. I'm actually very proud of that kill. Fuck! Fucking fuck! How? He is less than half a bar. He is like 0 0.2 of a bar. After I fucking hip fire him because he sucks shooting with an M2 carbine. Damn it, I should have had that kill. Uh, triggered. Fucking triggered. Holy shit on my dick. Fuck, there was too many people there. Why is there a Chaffee in our base? What the fuck? Why is there a Chaffee in our base? And the thing is... People will kill me and pick up my gun and they can fucking... They, they can... They can ADS. They don't care. Alright, let's do this. I kind of just ran around over here. Damn it. Push him out. There's only one guy left in this fucking objective now. Come on. There's gonna be reinforcements coming in from this side, so I'm just trying to like. There's a kill. I wounded that guy. Oh, that's a fucking grenade. Wasn't it? No! Yes! No! <laughs> ah! That was fucking funny as fuck. I was like, no! Yes! No! Yes! Oh. That was probably my best life yet. That was fucking great. Like, I sniped that guy on the fucking bike. I sniped the guy running in. I didn't kill them, but I hit them. And, I mean, we're fucking dead. But it was funny. And the only kills I got were with the actual gun this time. So, I don't... Oh, oh you fly all the fuck up to the world. Anyway. With that being done, um, I'll be honest, I expected this to go a lot better. Not quite as half as bad as this, but I still managed to walk away with at least more kills than this. I think it was like 26 to 16 or 27 to 16 in the end there. Um, so hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, let me know some challenges for me in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed this video, I'd love to see you in the next one. Cheers.